induction phase, the fresh gas flow well exceeds patient's minute ventilation. All the patient gas consumption is made up of fresh gas flow. Approximately half the gas goes to waste via scavenging. At lower fresh gas flows, patient's delivered minute ventilation is made up of both fresh gas and recycled gas. In this example, 40% of the patient's minute ventilation is from fresh gas flow and 60% from recycled gas. Two liters from fresh gas flow out of a minute ventilation of five liters per minute. As fresh gas flow is reduced, more recycled gas makes up the patient's delivered minute ventilation. As more recycled gas makes up the patient's delivered minute ventilation, the FiO2 decreases because oxygen is not being replenished from the fresh gas flow. At this rate, eventually most of the oxygen will be consumed within the recycled gas and there is a risk of delivering hypoxic mixture to the patient. But what if you had information on how much total oxygen you need within the fresh gas flow to maintain your target FiO2? EcoFlow provides data on the total oxygen required within the fresh gas flow to help ensure the minimum FiO2 target setting is achieved. In this example, the O2 total flow from both air and oxygen in green is below the target FiO2 of 25% represented by the blue flag. By increasing the oxygen flow at or above the FiO2 flag of 25% but maintaining the total flow of 1 liter, low flow can still be achieved but also ensuring the target FiO2 is maintained.